Assalamu alaikum grade 7 today we will complete worksheet here in the chapter 10 heat on the move and inshallah this will be our last lecture heat is a form of energy that travels from hot to cold bodies temperature tells us how hot or cold something is here you can see that the floor of earth is uh, going on with the process of conduction air is a poor conductor so it's doing convection conduction conduction is the process by which this fry pan and this saucepan is being hot convection currents these are the currents that are keeping our wind air and water circulating around the earth radiation it's the type of energy transfer by which we get energy from sun we get sunlight from sun and these are thermographs we have studied about them very well that these are the infrared imaging cameras uh, photographs that can sense the body temperature as well and they are very helpful in determining many things around us scientifically and technically they help us when we are detecting any tissue in the body that is hotter than the other parts of the body now we will do mcq's first question first question in eight story block of flats the boiler from the central heating system should be in basement second is which of the following is the best conductor iron third answer is insulator because ice is good insulator that's why it is used in igloo a man builds a hut with a corrugated iron roof so the whole day will be hot during the day a cool fire gives out heat mainly by a uh, convection and a coal fire convection and radiation because we're not uh, holding the coal we are staying away from it and we are getting it through air and through radiation winds from because air is cold is less dense than hot air i have shown you in the convection currents as well heat loss by convection current in a stoppered flask is prevented by making the a vacuum between the walls you can stop this video and you can mark your mcqs these are the correct answer this will help you now we will go, uh, go to seventh one uh, on a hot sunny day it will be coolest to who we are with loose white shirt okay this is the correct answer ninth is a certain kind of pie needs as hot as oven possible when the top shelf is there okay the best place to bake it will be the top shelf okay now on a hot day which cooler car will be the hottest inside dull black you know that black body absorbs the most of the heat and light which one of the following statement is true for conduction so the correct answer is it cannot take place in a vacuum okay which one of the following statement is true for convection the correct answer is uh, guess you can guess that uh, only take place in liquids is faster in radiation is always slower than conduction is faster in gases and then in liquids so d is the correct option 13th is which one of the following statement is true for radiation travels by movement of particles can only travel in air can only travel yeah it travels in straight line d can also be there but the c one is the best one now the 16th is modern buildings often have a double pan of glass in the windows because air trapped between the pans reduce the conduction now fill up type question number 2 is there where we have three options only a tile floor feels cold when you walk on it with the wet bare feet due to conduction heat from the sun travels to that through radiation only the water at bottom of an electric kettle is heated with convection the handle of a metal spoon left in hot coffee get hot through conduction a central heating radiator warms a room through convection a grill in the top of the oven heats the food be below it 
by radiation the seventh one is the air in the refrigerator is cool throughout even though the cooling element is at the top of the refrigerator through convection so i've changed the colors as well to make you understand better uh, now we will do question number three uh, the picture below shows the saucepan of a soup being heated on a stove the body and the bottom should be good conductor uh, so that heat can easily transfer and get in the into the soup uh, easily and the handle should not be a, a conductor it should be an insulator because the person who is cooking this dish should not get his uh, hand burned so the answer for question number one is the bottom of saucepan needs to be good conductor of heat to, so that it can transfer conduct heat from stove or hot plate to the soup uh, here it is shown stove you can heat or make soup in a hot plate too second answer is the handle of saucepan should be good insulator of heat so that it can stop heat traveling up the handle and should stop burning cook's hand so it should be comfortable for the cook so that it can handle the saucepan well now the question is that uh, the hand bottom should be made of good conductor good conductors are metals mostly stainless steel are used in making the wood uh, the at utensils now handle should be made of wood or plastic uh, you know wood and plastic are good insulators thanks for watching this video uh, take care keep practicing allah hafiz